This is Banjo, and today I'm going over how to create a simple unit respawn in your mission using Arma's built-in respawn system. We can see on the map we have a series of respawn markers and a series of playable units. Keep in mind this will only work in multiplayer, as single player uses team switching. The only thing you need to set up in the mission is the actual markers. We can see the units aren't named, with the exception of the main unit and this trigger as I'm using this trigger to simply kill the unit to make it quicker to respawn in. So we'll omit that for now. But taking a look at the mission, I've laid down three markers and they use the name of respawn underscore west. This marker is the respawn location for any western units and we can see the other markers have an underscore and a number after them. Having multiple markers will mean a random chance of spawning between them, and the only thing you have to enter is the prefix after respawn west. Place down as many as you desire. Placing more will increase the randomization between the marker locations. Now we'll take a look at the description.extension file. In the description.extension I have a pretty standard layout with mission data at the top, the class header displaying MA players, and average score, but the only information that matters for respawn are the two last values. Respawn equals and its type, and respawn delay and its type. The respawn equals value is if I'm using base or group or none, and respawn delay is the value in seconds before I'm able to respawn. There's multiple respawn types available to choose from, and we'll take a look at the BI wiki entry. Values can be either a number or a name. In the example, I'm using base, but three would have sufficed as well. You can read through all the entries here, and I'll link the page in the video description. But for this example, I'll simply be demonstrating the base respawn type, which we'll take a look at now. As the AI are killed off, we can hear the new spawning and giving their grid location. And as I respawn, we can see that I spawn in the lower Standing right market, by. doing it again, Standing we'll change by. the location up to the lower left marker, and Standing as I demonstrated by. a few more times, you'll get to see how it randomizes between the various markers Ready I've placed orders. down. Moving. This is the simplest respawn to set up, and I'll leave its examples Ready in the video description, but this week I'll be going over a few more complex types, so you can look out for those.